Freya, is it just me or is everything too quiet in our village? What do you think about this? I think the same thing. How are the other residents doing there? I don't know, but I think it's time to do something. Eat up, my family. This meal was prepared especially for us. Thank you, Sarah, for this meal. You're welcome. I made the food just so that you can eat well before you go about your business. Freya, it really pisses me off that everything is good and calm around. It doesn't bring me pleasure. We need to do something about it. We need to wait until the red moon appears and start our hike. JJ's great idea. Then the red moon has already come. Can we finally go and give the villagers some kind of gift? Of course. You've got everything you need, haven't you? Then we'll go to the main building and show them what a real blood moon is. The food is so delicious. I'm even sorry that we couldn't eat everything on the table. Hmm? Who is that there? Open up and take a look. Suddenly it's something important. Mikey, you won't believe me if you don't go yourself. Our city hall, our mayor is there, and it's terrible there. Go take a look for yourself. I'll warn the others for now. What could have happened while we were eating our food? We need to go check it out. Sarah, stay close to Mikey Jr. Mikey Jr., don't go far from Mom. Now we'll find out what happened there. What is so terrible that we will see there? Maybe they hung curtains? Or maybe a new carpet? Ha <laughs> ha. What? Ah! Huh? <sighs> this is some kind of horror. Where is the blood coming from? Hmm? What kind of body is this? How did you end up here in the first place? Who did all this? Mikey, maybe we should call JJ so that you can figure it all out together. We need to check the town hall completely first. Suddenly, they are still alive here. Although the further we go, the less I believe that there is at least someone alive here. It's a pity that we didn't get here in time. We could have saved at least a couple of people from this. I don't know, Mikey. You shouldn't blame yourself for what these stupid people did. What a horror! How could anyone have thought of such a thing? It's just incredible! They set everything on fire here, and soon there will be nothing left. What will happen then? There won't be anything here at all. There doesn't seem to be anything else to look at on the second floor. If I'm not mistaken, there should still be a basement and the descent there should be close to the kitchen. Let's go there. Suddenly, all those who managed to escape from these villains gathered there. <laughs> there really is a descent down there. I'm scared, but we still need to see what happened there. What? JJ, what are you doing here? Don't come near us. Get away from us all! Let's run, family! We can't stay here anymore! Mikey, why are you running away from me? Have I done anything wrong to you? <coughs> well, then I'll have to do something. It's a pity that everything turned out this way. I really didn't want to do it. Don't lie to me! You're stupid! Mikey Jr., run after me! We need to hide! <coughs> Mikey, would you like to avenge them? Where are you running to? Are you afraid of me? Then you better not bother me. Stay where you are. I'm going to have to do the same thing I did to your family. Stay where you are. Don't do this. I won't bother you. Just let them all go. I can't. <laughs> Unfortunately, I can't. Huh? Where am I? You're not a fool to wake up. So that you don't bother me anymore, I put you in this cage. You don't have to try to escape from here. There's a bunch of guards standing here, and you're underwater right now. That's why you'd better sit here. I won't do anything bad to your family. What should I do now? How do I get out, hmm? Who is that there? It seems he has come to save me. Hey, dude, look here. I'm here. Please help me. There's a guard here. Be careful. Mikey, how could you get here? I can't believe it. It's a pity that you ended up here. But I can help you. Get out of here. I'll be waiting for you. <laughs> I hope this weapon is enough for you to deal with all the guards here. If not, then I'll look for a stronger person. Don't worry. I am that strong man. Now I'm going to show all these guards a master class on what not to do in life so as not to get in the face or die later. Hey you, are you standing here and watching me? Then why am I going to knock you all out so easily now? Great job. Well done. And now we need to destroy this pendulum that gives them strength. Then it will be much easier for you to kill them. We are doing this in order to destroy their base from the protection that stands here. And you can also take these diamond blocks for yourself. You need to kill everyone here so that JJ can't take over our village so easily. What should I do now? Kill the other guards? Exactly. They're standing over there. If you kill them, then you'll make it easier for the rest of the guys who want to get out of here. But you don't have to worry about it. You have to do one thing. Then it won't be a problem for me at all! They're just weaklings who thought it would be easy to work here. But it turned out that it wasn't. 
because I've run away now. Good. Now we have to go back to the village from here. JJM has caused a total nightmare. You're not going to like this, but it will be an incentive for you to save everyone. Guys, look at the camera. Give your regards to your father. Mikey, please don't listen to them. Everything will be fine with us. Save our village. We're already here. And now look towards your house. Do you see JJ there? You need to finish him off right now. I hope for you. Hey, JJ. It seems you've confused your house with mine. That's why you need to get as far away from here as possible and never come near my house or my family again. Mikey, it seems you've become quite impudent. I'll show you who's boss here. But first you need to calm down and try to talk to me. Then stay where you are. I'm coming now, and you're going to tell me everything you wanted to tell me. Or are you afraid of me? Why do you want to run away from me so badly? You just don't understand the situation you're in right now. I don't know how you escape from there, but it doesn't matter anymore. Something else is more important. What could be more important than stopping a villain like you? Can you tell me? Or don't you have anything else to say? There is something much more important than me. I'm sorry to say this, but you should see what's on this flash drive. Then you'll understand everything. Good luck to you. I don't understand it at all. But maybe it's really something important. I need to check it out right now. I should have a computer at home where I can see what is in this flash drive. Huh? Mikey, don't listen to what they told you! Save our village! We'll be fine! Don't worry about us! Mikey, you seem to love them. Then why don't you come here and save them? Oh, it seems you'll have more important things to do than us. What? Crocodiles, it's time for you to do what I raised you to do. Go to the village and you can eat everything you see on the way. JJ's basement. But what's outside? Hmm? A bunch of crocodiles? So they were telling me about it? Well, I'll have to kill all these crocodiles in order to save my family. I'm really sorry that I have to do this. But crocodiles, soon you will all die. And don't think that you will be able to escape from me. You are unlucky that you are my main enemy. And since you want to eat all those in the village, then you want to eat my friends and neighbors. And I can't let you do that. Don't even ask me! I'm going to kill you all and go to JJ to save my family that they stole and imprisoned in some kind of cell! I know they're there! If I were you, I wouldn't try to stop me! This is a big mistake for you! I will destroy everything that scares me here! I don't like that there are all these things in his yard! These are just terrible things! Now I have to go to his house! Did he close the doors? Then will I have to break down this door or make it much easier? Break down the wall next to it! It will kill much faster! Absolutely! And now I need to get into his basement! Hey, JJ! Didn't you know that I could get in here? You made a big mistake to let me live back then! You should have dealt with me first! And now you're going to have to die at my hands for everything you've done to our village! Most importantly for what you did to my family! Don't think you can beat us so easily! Let's see who's who! Mm -hmm. How persistent you are! Well, then I'll give you a gift. Do you know which one? I'll kill you as fast as I can, so that you don't suffer as I see everything that you have done around. Oh, Sarah! Mikey Jr! Are you okay? I hope it's there. They didn't do anything to you, did they? I'm so glad you're okay. Mikey, you're so good. Everything is fine with us. Freya, how are you? Let's take a walk around the city. Let's go visit Mikey. Mm -hmm. Hey, Mikey, is that you? It's been a long time since we've seen each other. How are you doing? Oh, hello, Bum. Yes, I'm doing great. I've dug up a whole mine of diamonds. Now all that remains is to sell it. I will become super rich. Sorry, but my wife whispered to me that she doesn't want to talk to poor guys like you. Are you kidding me? Are you serious about that now? He really dug up all the diamonds from this mine. What a fool Mikey is. He didn't bet me anything. What are we going to do now? He became somehow arrogant. We need to find a way to get rich to punish him. But how can we punish him? I think you've already figured out what I was talking about. Mm -hmm. This guy knows the best way to prank Mikey. He has a whole store about it. All right. Hi, guys. I think I know why you came here. Do you want to prank your friend? Then you've come to the right place. But in order to do this, you need to pay me $64. I hope you have that kind of money. Well, I think I can find this money to prank Mikey. It seems like I should have that kind of money in my pocket. 
Uh, it seems not. What should I do now? We need to come up with something. Hmm? Freya, do you see this poster? It says, money. Then we go there. I think we will find the answer to this question there. It seems that this is a mine where you need to find the keys to the chest where the money will be. Then I wish you good luck finding the key. But they're unlucky that I'm a great miner. Therefore, I definitely have the patience to dig all the sand that is here. Of course. You did a great job, JJ. I think you can definitely find the key to this stupid chest. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, hey, I found the key. Now let's open the chest and see what $64 is in there. That's exactly how much we need. Let's go quickly to that seller before he goes anywhere and give him all this money. I don't think he's going anywhere until you buy his product. You're the only one like that in the whole village. I hope so, too. Well, hello, salesman. You haven't left yet, have you? Great. Then, take your $64. Wow. Dude, well done. Then here's your potion. Throw it on yourself and you'll fall asleep. And when you wake up, you'll already be this monster to prank your friend. At any moment, you will become like before. Uh, uh. Mm -hmm. I think I've really become this clown. Now I'll wait for the night and now I can start my prank plan. It seems Mikey is still awake and he's out there having fun with his family. I think this is the perfect moment to prank him. Did he really notice me? Well, then there's no time to hide. I need to change my voice. Hi, Mikey and his family. It seems you've been bad this year. I've come to punish you. Ha ha ha. <laughs> what is it? Don't you recognize your friend? <laughs> then maybe we'll get to know each other better. <laughs> or don't you want to? JJ, is that you? Are you completely... Did you not like this prank? Ah ha ha ha. Then you better change your pants. Huh? I think you peed yourself. What? And now I'm disappearing from this house. Knock knock, guys. You are so rich. I wanted to ask you something. Do you have a couple of dollars? I'd like to buy myself some food. Please help me. JJ, better admit where the cameras are. Or at what point will you say it's a prank? What? Guys, what are you talking about? Who JJ is? What kind of cameras? Don't pretend. You'd better wear a better suit next time. Now you won't come here anymore. Hmm? Hmm. What a beautiful day. I'm sure Mikey is still thinking how to get back at me for that prank. Ha <laughs> ha. Huh? What's going on there? Why are the police there? Hey guys, what's going on there? Why are the police standing here? Didn't you hear that? It's all over the papers. That nut killed Larry, the kindest person in the village. Can you imagine? Whoa. What a horror. What will happen to Mikey? He probably didn't do it on purpose. On purpose or not, the police will find out about everything now. Hey, Mr. Mikey and his family, please leave the house. If you don't come out and talk to us, then we'll have to use force. If you don't come out now, then we'll kick down the door. What? What happened? Who are you? You are accused of killing Larry. What? Ah! You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say will be used against you in court. It's not him. I promise you. Now shut up. Quickly put your head against the wall and your hands behind your back. You are going to jail right now, even without clarifying the circumstances, because you don't want to admit it. <laughs> what happened here anyway? I didn't have time to understand anything. Freya, we have to do something about it. Although Mikey is a fool, he wouldn't kill a man. How do you know that? Although you're right! Mr. Policeman, I promise you it's not me. I'm tired of saying it a million times. Exactly? Ah! What do you say now? <laughs> you have no choice at all now. <laughs> Get out of the village, otherwise I'll have to kill you. <laughs> How could that happen? It's all because of stupid JJ. I thought he wanted to prank me again and take my money. But nothing! I'll come up with something to get back at him and to all the villagers, especially this stupid officer. Huh? It's also raining! What a bad luck! Someone tell me! Why do I need all this? Is it because I suddenly became rich? Or maybe because I did something wrong? I can't believe it happened in one day like this! Ah! <laughs> huh? I, what is that? Have I suddenly become bigger? Or has everything around me become small? I think I've really gotten big, and my hands have turned into saws! Oh. Huh? Huh? What are those sounds? Why is Mikey like that? What's going on in the village street? Freya, let's go find out what's going on with the village. Then this is great news! Now I can definitely take revenge on the whole universe! Ha ha ha! Why is he so big and has saws on his hands? He seems to have lost his mind, that's for sure. Now we must try to talk to him. 
Are you going to talk to this monster? Are you really sure about this? Oh, I'm sure of it. Hey, Mikey, do you hear me? I hear you, JJ, but wait a bit, and I'll have another surprise for you. First, I need to take revenge on this stupid policeman for what he did to my family. Oh. Don't do this, Mikey. You're so much better than that. No, Mr. Policeman. What is it? It seems you're not as brave as you used to be. Or what? Don't you have anything else to say? It seems so. I think you're definitely finished. Mikey, stop it. You're not that angry. No, can you even hear me? Why don't you talk to me? Because what you're doing is not normal. He doesn't seem to hear me at all. We have to do something. Mikey, remember the family. They probably aren't happy about it. What did you say? Do you even realize that this is all because of you? You're to blame for all this with your pranks. What? What does this have to do with me? Let's talk. It seems it's all because of the red moon in the sky. Oh. Now we can speak the same language. Good, I get you. It seems you don't want to 